A world with self-driving cars that pick you up at a tap on your phone. Sounds like the future, right? Tesla's robot taxi is aiming to bring this vision to life, letting you skip the hassle of driving. But here's the real question. Can we actually trust a car to drive itself safely? So our autonomous future is, is here. Um, as I said, we've got 50 Teslas driving autonomously. Um, we're trying to give you a sense of what, what cities will be like in the future. Tesla claims their robo-taxis will change transportation as we know it, but there are still serious doubts. Accidents, software errors, and unpredictable problems make this a big risk. With all the excitement, it's easy to overlook the dangers, but are we rushing into something we might regret? While Tesla paints a picture of convenience and innovation, the reality may be far more complex. I just kind of believe that the car should be driven by a person. I couldn't trust, I wouldn't trust it. I can't imagine a car driving off the bridge and then navigating around here with all the people walking and... So, is this robo-taxi future worth the risk? Let's dig into why trusting this technology might be a gamble. To really understand Tesla's robotaxis, let's start with the basics of autonomous driving. Self-driving tech is all about cars using cameras, sensors, and smart software to see the road and make driving decisions. Tesla's approach to this tech is unique. Unlike other companies that use complex setups with radar and LiDAR, which are like laser sensors, Tesla sticks mostly with cameras. They believe these cameras combined with advanced artificial intelligence, can make the best decisions on the road, just like a human driver would. But this is where it gets tricky. Building a car that can drive itself in any situation isn't as simple as putting cameras everywhere. Roads are unpredictable with pedestrians, bikers, and unexpected obstacles. Tesla's system, called Full Self-Driving, FSD, is constantly learning from real-world data which Tesla owners share every time they drive. So, Tesla is always updating its software to improve its driving. But even with all this data, there's no guarantee that it can handle everything perfectly. The technology is still evolving, and there's a long way to go before it's truly foolproof. With this background in mind, let's dig deeper into the risks that come with self-driving tech. Self-driving technology may seem futuristic and amazing, but it's full of complicated issues and risks. One of the biggest challenges is that these cars rely on artificial intelligence to make split-second decisions. Decisions that, in certain situations, even experienced human drivers find difficult. For instance, a self-driving car might struggle with something as simple as spotting a child running across the street or recognizing a construction zone with confusing signs. Unlike humans, AI doesn't think. It only processes what it has been programmed or trained to recognize. Tesla's robotaxis face these same risks. Since Tesla mainly uses cameras, there's a limitation in understanding the depth and exact distance of objects. Other companies include Radar and LiDAR to help with this, which makes their systems potentially safer in complex situations. But Tesla believes their camera-based approach combined with constant software updates, will be enough. However, this approach has shown flaws in the past, with reports of accidents where the system misjudged obstacles or didn't respond quickly enough. There's also the issue of over-reliance. People may start to trust these cars too much, believing they can fully handle all driving situations. But if the car faces a situation it hasn't seen before, it might respond unpredictably. What's with all that noise? For weeks now, citizens in San Francisco have been pulling their collective hair out over the incessant sound of honking horns. It's 4 a.m. Help. Another driverless crash on the streets of Phoenix. At that time, they were still having glitch in, in, this, in, the, in, the, uh, in the vehicle where they were uh, crashing and stuff like that. And so nowadays, I still have that fear. And the stakes are high. Mistakes in self-driving cars can lead to accidents or even fatalities. Waymo has a good technology with a good track record, but it's not perfect. So while self-driving tech is exciting, it's clear that we're still far from a perfect, risk-free system.
One major issue with Tesla's robo-taxis is safety. In the real world, even small mistakes by autonomous cars can have big consequences. Tesla's full self-driving feature, or FSD, has faced several incidents that raise questions about its reliability. Video shows the moment an out-of-control Tesla drives into an Ohio convention center. Police say the driver ran a red light and was going around 70 miles per hour. Authorities say the Tesla driver was taken to the hospital in stable condition and that the person was cited for failure to control their vehicle. There have been cases where Teslas on autopilot crashed into parked emergency vehicles or failed to stop at red lights. These are serious issues because when a car doesn't respond to basic road rules, it endangers everyone around it. Part of the problem is that self-driving technology isn't perfect yet. It's still learning, and it sometimes makes mistakes when faced with unexpected situations. For example, a robo-taxi might struggle to recognize unusual road signs or respond slowly in sudden situations, like a pedestrian stepping off the curb. These split-second reactions are crucial for safe driving, and unfortunately, current autonomous systems sometimes fall short. Just when I would start to drift off, all of a sudden there's another couple of honks, you know? And they're just little honk, honk, you know, it's short, but it's enough. Tesla's cars gather data from millions of miles driven by real people, which helps improve the system. But despite these updates, there are no guarantees it can handle every possible situation. With each incident, people become more cautious about trusting these robo-taxis. Safety is at the core of any driving experience. And until Tesla can address these concerns fully, doubts will remain about whether robo-taxis can be trusted to keep everyone safe on the road. Robo-taxis, like Teslas, are different from traditional cars, and that makes them harder to trust. In a regular car, we know a person is behind the wheel, making decisions based on experience, instincts, and emotions. But in a robo-taxi, every decision is made by software and sensors, which don't understand the world in the same way we do. This difference makes people nervous, because while we can predict what a human might do in certain situations, it's harder to predict what a robo-taxi will do. Another reason robo-taxis are tough to trust is the lack of accountability. If a human driver makes a mistake, they're held responsible, but when a self-driving car has an accident, it's not always clear who's to blame. Tesla? The car owner? Or the software itself? This gray area creates hesitation among potential riders who may wonder how safe they really are in a car without a human driver. Imagine a situation where a robo-taxi has to choose between hitting another car or a pedestrian. It's a split-second decision, and with a human driver, we could understand their choice based on instinct or reflex. But with an autonomous car, these decisions are based on preset programming. That makes people wonder who decided how these cars make life or death choices. And is it fair to let a machine make those calls? Also, there's the fear of technology malfunctioning. Unlike regular cars, robotaxes rely heavily on software, which can glitch or fail. These cars are incredibly advanced, but that doesn't mean they're perfect. Until self-driving tech feels as reliable as human drivers, trust will continue to be an issue. Beyond safety and ethics, there's a huge economic gamble with robotaxis. I wanted to make some important changes that I think would improve the, the robotaxi, the thing, that, thing that we're, the main thing that we're going to show, and, and we're also going to show off a couple of other things. Tesla has poured billions of dollars into developing this self-driving technology, expecting it to transform the way we travel. But it's a risky investment. If robotaxis don't gain widespread trust or fail to perform as promised, Tesla could face major financial losses. Not only would this affect the company, but it could also impact the investors and employees who rely on Tesla's success. Operating robo-taxes also comes with high costs. These cars need advanced hardware, regular updates, and specialized maintenance, which isn't cheap. If these costs get passed down to customers, it's unclear if enough people would actually pay for the service, especially if they're unsure about the safety or reliability of robo-taxes. 
There's also the potential effect on jobs. If robo-taxis become popular, it could mean fewer jobs for human drivers, like those in rideshare services. This shift could hurt local economies, where driving jobs are essential for income. Overall, Tesla's robo-taxi vision is an expensive bet, with consequences that could reshape not only the car industry, but also the economy and job market in unpredictable ways. A big roadblock for Tesla's robotaxis is the legal and regulatory system. Self-driving cars operate in a legal gray area because current laws aren't designed for vehicles without a human driver. Different states and countries have their own rules, making it hard for Tesla to launch robotaxis worldwide. With version 12.5 and maybe 12.6, but pretty soon, we will ask regulatory approval of the Tesla supervised FSD in Europe, China, and other countries. I think we're likely to receive that before the end of the year. In some places, they'll face strict safety checks and long approval processes before robo-taxes can operate. Plus, the more incidents involving self-driving cars, the more likely it is that new laws will limit or slow down their rollout. Lawmakers are already cautious about autonomous vehicles, and any negative headlines about robo-taxes will only add pressure. These setbacks mean that even if Tesla's tech is ready, legal challenges could still delay or even stop the robo-taxi revolution in some regions, making it a risky and unpredictable path forward. So, is Tesla's robo-taxi vision really worth all these risks? On one hand, there's the dream, a world where cars drive themselves, reducing the need for human drivers, and making travel cheaper and potentially safer. Tesla's robo-taxis could transform cities, reduce traffic accidents, and open up new ways of getting around. For many, the benefits sound incredible and futuristic. But on the other hand, the risks are hard to ignore. From safety concerns to ethical questions, and even financial and legal challenges, Tesla has a long road ahead before people fully trust robotaxis. The technology is impressive, but isn't foolproof, and the stakes are high. A single major incident could lead to a huge backlash, damaging trust in self-driving tech and setting back Tesla's goals. In the end, the choice to trust robotaxis might come down to individual comfort levels and whether people are willing to take that leap of faith. Our expectation by mid-2025, you'll have rides out. Now, it depends on the city in terms of the regulatory and how Tesla navigates that, but this is not years away now. I mean, we're talking months. And it speaks to my view, this is an autonomous AI story. They're actually going to be the ones that lead what I really almost view as like an FSD autonomous revolution. While Tesla's vision is bold and exciting, only time will tell if the benefits will truly outweigh the risks. If you're fascinated by the future of tech, you'll want to stick around for more updates on the wild world of self-driving cars, robo-taxes, and all things cutting edge. Don't miss out. Hit the like button, subscribe, and ring that notification bell so you're always in the loop. The tech world's changing fast, and we'll make sure you're right here for every twist and turn.